Hi Taurus, how are you? Well, I'm Shara from Charlie's Angel Tarot and Buddy Advice on Facebook. Um, I've got four cards, one card for each week, and I've got a theme card, and I'm keeping that a secret until the end. And then I've got the big arcana, tarot stones, and I call them the tarot ruins, um, as an extra, and that has got the tarot message, so you get an extra message and a spiritual message. These stones were made by Timothy Henley, and um, he turned it into a spiritual message. All right, in the first week, we have the Two of Air, the Two of Swords. And you can see that unicorns are fighting here. And this card means you, uh, you are unable to see what's in front of you and you are up in the air about something and you can't make a decision. In week four, you have the Four of Water. And this is the only card besides the Aces that offer the... Um, that there is an offer that you cannot see. Sorry, uh, the flash is, is the TV, I've put it off. Um, those are the only five cards that have a hand coming out of the cloud, and that's the hand from the universe or from God offering you something. And in the only difference of this card, the Four of Cups and the Aces, is that in, in the Four of Cups, you cannot see the offer that is in front of you. Perhaps you are bored, perhaps you are daydreaming, perhaps you are thinking too much, perhaps you are too much in your mind because you can't make a decision. So just be aware of what is going around you and stop focusing on one thing. Because you most probably have to make a decision uh, about two things or more. Um, then in the third week you have the page of earth and that could mean that you might get an offer for a new job or a job interview, something that is for long lasting um, and long lasting and uh, like a salary is long lasting so you can um, sign a contract of something or perhaps it's a new study. Um, but anything, it's something that you will uh, get many rewards out of because it is an earthly card. It is the, uh, the coin card. So it is something to do with work or study. Uh, uh, then we have um, the Ace of Fire for the fourth week and the uh, or staves. And the uh, fire stands for creativity, passion and action, and also for career or work. So there might be a new offer, like I said, you might receive news of an offer of a new job. So there is a new beginning for you as well, but you, you might even get more than one job offer or a uh, or you might get offered two different schools or universities and you have to take a decision as to where you want to go. Be careful about pondering too much because you need time and rest. And this is uh, with the following cards. This is just what I mean. Uh, you have for the theme card, you have green. And that is number 31. So that's four. I think you need stability. You are wishing for stability. And you're too much in your head because of these two cars, the first week and the second week. But by the end of the month, you most probably have taken the decision as there is a new beginning. Um, it also, it says it in Dutch, green, groen. And it says, blow your nervous system clear. So let's go outside into the nature and let, let the wind blow through your hair and wipe away those cobwebs. Or take time out 
um, through meditation or just listen to relaxing music and meditate on the color green. Green also means for me money. You've got another green card there and that is also the coin card. Money, uh, space, healing, health um, and rest. So then we come to the tarot stone or the tarot rune and you've got number nine. You're at the end of the phase and you're ready for the new start. Also, this is the hermit. It is um, a lantern or an oil lamp, if you can see that. And the hermit in the traditional tarot deck looks like this. It's an old wise man. He's following the light of the lamp which is shining on the path ahead of him. He's an old wise man, like, like I said, but he's all, the hermit is also somebody that um, doesn't mingle. Please be careful that you don't isolate yourself. Go out into nature and be on your own from time to time to recuperate so that you can join in <coughs> when the crowds are there like in a study, in a classroom, or at work, for you're ready to go into action with this ace. Gather your knowledge and your courage and go forth, follow the path. The light is on the path, it's illuminated for you. All right, the spiritual message from the hermit is this. Traditional meanings, security, I'm talking about a new job or a study. These two cards, making decisions. Perfectionist, solitude and revitalizing. Revitalizing and solitude. This stone reminds you that now is not a good time to isolate yourself from others, like I said, in an attempt to deal with life's problems. You might be receiving a lesson in humility are, you, are your old be, uh, behavior patterns and outmoded habits working for you the way you need them to? Ask this question when you're on your own. And this is the spiritual message. Could things be any better than they are? Things can always improve because nothing is perfect in this life. Just enjoy it and take the time out and learn how to be solace and how to retreat and how to evaluate, how to meditate, how to manifestate and life will be an adventure and it will be easier to make a decision. And then you'll be able to see what's in front of you instead of pondering too much and look at the offers that are in front of you and the, the new beginning. Go for it, um, Taurus. I hope you've enjoyed this reading. I just would like to mention just a couple of things. Please give me a thumbs up, share and like with family and friends, and thank you for being here. And um, you can click on the membership button. Um, it is totally free of charge nothing it doesn't cost you a penny and click on the bell so you will be notified sorry if i don't speak properly this is actually why i started doing the videos uh, for my intonation uh, my diction and the way uh, to speak properly uh, sometimes i stumble over my words not only because i am uh, bilingual but also because i've had two car accidents and this is was one of the results of the accident. I hope you don't mind. I thank you for your understanding and hope to see you in December again.